Welcome. Today we're going to talk about integrating a secure FTP files with Salesforce.com using the Informatica Cloud. So let's go ahead and get started. Now the first thing we want to do is make sure our FTP um, setup is, is secure. So we go to our secure FTP client. I have FilesDilla right here. And you can see where I picked um, secure FTP. And this is actually my computer. And I, just, I went to my computer for simplicity. And then username and password. Um, but we're going through the secure FTP protocol. And then of course your home sites can end up being home administrator FTP files for my case, um, where I'm going to have this file called accountdata.csv. All right, so that's, that shows you that the file server is live. Now let's go ahead and run over here to Informatica Cloud. All right, so the first thing we want to do is set up our connection. So I have one set up right here called SFTP. Um, and this is pretty cool because it allows you to give it a name. Uh, you pick secure FTP out of the list of types of connections. Um, and then this is your FTP information. So administer a password, uh, just like I had with my FileZilla client. Uh, my local host, my local directory, uh, my remote directory. Now this local directory gives me a list of the template files that I should expect in the remote directory. Right, so whatever file format you're going to get in your remote directory, um, you simply copy a copy of it over here in your local directory, and you can see mine, FTPN, um, is this account data, the same thing that we have in the secure FTP directory. All right, and that form, file format, of course, has things like, uh, in this case, marketing app ID, account ID, area code, and so on. All right, so uh, now we go down and uh, we're all done there. Let's hit OK. Now let's make a new integration, right? So we can get a data synchronization. And I'll go ahead and make this bigger for you so you can see it. Um, let's make a new data synchronization task. And we can get account from FTP. All right. Uh, and then we can, uh, of course, upsert that into Salesforce if we want to. All right, so now our source is going to be that FTP connection that we just selected. Um, and then, of course, there's our template file right there, right? So this will be the same uh, file name and file type that's back on your other system. And, of course, you can pick different limiters if it's different types of files. Um, now we pick our target, and uh, here we can just pick our Salesforce connection. So we're going to take that file that we got from the secure FTP server, and we're going to put it into Salesforce. So let's go ahead and put it in a Salesforce account. Now we get to find the data filter. This is pretty nice uh, to define those business rules for moving data. For example, if I only want things that actually have a phone number, right? Right, I can do that, or I could pick something else. All right, so I define our data filters. Now we can do a field mapping. This is kind of neat because on the left side, these are those secure FTP um, accounts that I want to grab. And on the right side, these are my Salesforce accounts that I want to get. Uh, now, you notice a lot of things are already mapped for me. Um, the rest of it is just a matter of drag and drop. So, for example, I can take my account name, uh, match it over to name. If I'm looking for my phone number, I can, of course, match over two things uh, and make it really easy to deal with. So, it concatenates them together. If I want to get more advanced, I can come into my expression editor, and I have about 150 Excel-like functions that I can use pretty easily. So, if you know Excel, you can use this system as well. All right, and that's really it for the field mapping. Um, going on to the next step where we define our schedule. Um, I can have this thing run every day, so pick up a file every day and map it, um, or do any kind of schedule that I want. Uh, but in this case, we'll go ahead and save it. All right, so now let's go. We got our, our test all set up and ready to go. So now we can go over here and we can run this test. The task that we created, um, the get accounts from SFTP. And right here, what we're doing is we're grabbing that information from that secure FTP server, um, and on the fly, processing it into salesforce.com with our true integration. Um, and all of it happens in just a few seconds. Um, and that's it for today. Thank you very much for your time.